So let me talk about the context of COVID. I'm going to give you something a little bit different to this because typically when I see a crisis, it is usually associated with a particular brand. And that's fine, but this is not a traditional crisis. COVID is a shared community experience. The crisis, however, and you might not agree with me on this, but let me explain. The crisis is in fact man-made through political policy. The government is who chose to shut the economy down. So whilst we want to blame COVID, our response is actually about the economic impact and the social impact. But don't fool yourself that COVID is the main part of this. At the end of the day, it's broader than that. But the reality is, the crisis is not the issue. Business continuity is the issue. And it is simultaneously the crisis at the same time. So the crisis that we respond to this moment, and hopefully for the last 43 days we've been working on this, is one, the shared experience that the community, that all of our stakeholders within our organizations and external to have. And it is the economic confusion that businesses are having as a result to uh, policy reaction. Because that's what continues to perpetuate the crisis for us as brands as businesses is the lack of clarity and is the expected confusion but our job in communicating our way through this crisis and getting out of this crisis is actually finding ways to lessen the storm that we have we are not in effect defending our brand which would be the traditional crisis communication approach what we are doing is defending and charting our business continuity. So that needs to be our crisis response. What are we doing to move forward and to keep all of our stakeholders connected within our ecosystems and the new ecosystems that we may need to create in order to succeed well into the future? So the traditional rules of crisis management don't apply. New stratagems need to be embraced. 